हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू अवर चैनल दिस इज डिजिटल मैराथन वीडियो सीरीज वेयर वी आर गोइंग टू आस्क यू फोर्टी टू चैलेंजेस एंड आई हैव ऑलरेडी आस्क फर्स्ट चैलेंज फ्रॉम यू एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू द सोल्यूशन ऑफ द फर्स्ट चैलेंज दैट आई आस्ट एंड आई रियली अप्रिशिएट योर पार्टिसिपेशन मैनी ऑफ यू ट्राई टू आंसर इट सम ऑफ यू आंसर इट करेक्टली आल्सो बट फॉर ऑल अदर्स आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू द सोल्यूशन नाउ इन दिस वीडियो नाउ विदाउट वेस्टिंग मच टाइम लेट इज गेट स्टार्टेड friend the first challenge that i asked was you have to draw a digital logic design to generate a pulse signal as shown in a figure so this is the first pulse signal and its behavior is for the first clock cycle it should remain zero and the second clock cycle it should go high and for the other two clock cycles it should remain zero and for the next clock cycle it should go high and it should keep on repeating the same behavior and the only input to our logic is clock signal Now I am going to give you solution. I am going to give you two solutions. What I think are the most optimized ones. The first solution is this solution is given by many of the members and viewers in the comment section, and this is the most appropriate one. Here we will simply use a MOR three counter, and it has two outputs Q one and Q zero, and its truth table is like this. Firstly, it goes to zero zero. Then the next state is zero one, and the next one is one zero, and then it roll back to zero zero. Now see the output Q zero. It is zero first, then goes to one, which is just aligned with our pulse signal. Then it goes zero in the third clock cycle. In the fourth clock cycle, again it is zero after roll back, and the fifth clock cycle it is one, which is matching exactly with the pulse signal behavior. So if we can consider this Q zero as a pulse signal. that is our answer now let us move towards our second solution a ring counter a simple three bit ring counter which uses three flip flops output of the first flip flop is going at the input of the second flip flop and output of the second flip flop is going at the input of the third flip flop and output of the third flip flop is going at the input of the first flip flop but the only thing is the reset value of first flip flop is 1 and the reset values of second and third flip flop is 0 and i am taking output of the second flip flop as my expected output which is pulse signal and friends from the behavioral expectation of a ring counter this one keep on rotating among these three flip flops and at a time output of only one flip flop will be high and at that time output of other two flip flops will be always zero as soon as the reset is released the output of first flip flop will be high and the output of second flip flop will be zero and the output of third flip flop will also be zero that means zero is the expectation as per our pulse signal also in the next clock cycle this one will be transferred at the output of second flip flop and the output of third and first flip flop will be zero and this one is our expectation now in the next clock cycle this one will be transferred at the output of third flip flop and the output of first and second flip flop will be zero zero is my next expectation and in the next clock cycle this one will be transferred at the output of first flip flop at that time out of second flip flop and third flip flop will be zero and that is also my expectation and in the next clock cycle fifth clock cycle this one will be transferred again at the out of second flip flop and we will get one here which is my pulse signal friends i hope that this would have answered the first problem statement and you would have understand it and with this i am going to end this video and i hope that this would be informative for all of you If you also like this video please press the like button and share your feedback in the comment section and in future we are going to create many such videos so to be aligned with our channel don't forget to subscribe it and press the bell icon to get the notification of all the upcoming videos thank you so much for watching